Hi, Helena here with your Love in Minute. I remember when I was first married after sex, my husband and I would laugh about that wet spot. Whose was it really? Well, if the man has ejaculated, it's very likely some of it is his. But ladies, I've got some news for you. Some of it may be yours. And it's not that milky white lubricant that usually facilitates intercourse, but a different clear fluid. The tantrics call it Amrita. And it's considered to be a blessing for it's a deep and powerful release for the woman. And it's very magical. It can come out in just little dribs and drabs, or it can rush out like a river. So if you're prone to this sort of thing, you might want to put some pads on the bed to absorb it so that you can relax and allow it to just flow freely. But of course, you want to make sure that you don't make a goal out of this. We've got too many goals in life. And besides, this is really subject to your high arousal and deep relaxation. So if you're working it, you're really not relaxed. Now there's a lot of information about Amrita on drg.com. That's D-O-C-T-O-R-G.com. He's done a study on it. And one of the things that he's learned is that in your first squirt, there might be a little ureic acid because this fluid comes out of the skein's glands and through the urethra. But after the first squirt, it's all Amrita. So let yourself go, relax, be bathed in the warmth of your juices, and love the experience. It's good for you. And if you've got any questions about it, please feel free to write me at loveandlifetools.com. See you soon.